Advanced treatments for strokes are helping patients have better outcomes. In tonight's SSM Health Medical Minute, Laura Simon spoke with a neurologist about how they help patients recover. Dr. Jacob Kitchener is a neurologist at SSM Health. He says there are two primary types of stroke, ischemic and hemorrhagic. The two main treatments up front for ischemic strokes are medicines that will thin the blood out, sometimes referred to as a clot buster, and then also medicines that can remove a blockage of a larger blood vessel. We use this term thrombectomy. So what we've done is we've instituted a network where we're able to see images from afar. Medication, surgery, or other procedures may be needed to stop the bleeding and save brain tissue when dealing with a hemorrhagic stroke. Unfortunately, once a stroke happens, you are at risk again for having another stroke. There are varying numbers, but the number I typically use is for an ischemic stroke, one out of every six people will go on to have another one within the first five years. Doctors use the acronym FAST to educate the public about stroke symptoms, face drooping, arm weakness, speech difficulties, and time. For the SSM Health Medical Minute, I'm Laura Simon.